in two and a half months. It just feels great to get out here. The beaches in Florida are officially open. I'm super excited. So I just had to get out here and do some surf fishing. For one, the bite's been good. If you know anything about this channel, I go where the bite's at. So you're gonna see an assortment of different fishing every single video. From, so if there's a good bite offshore, we're going offshore. If there's a good bite on the beach, we're staying here. Apparently the early morning bite's been good. So I'm gonna go ahead Get everything ready. Let's see if we can catch some fish. I'm going with the cut shrimp right here, guys. Now, I like to peel my shrimp before I put them on the hook. It's personal preference. You can do either. I personally think it works better. And uh, I got these big jumbo shrimp from Publix grocery store. Super cheap there. Let's go to Publix, get you some shrimp, and you're fishing. And these peeled shrimp, man, like a lot of people, I like to doctor up their baits nowadays and use all the beads and the fish bites and I'm sure that works but I grew up surf fishing back in the day and we just used whatever we could get our hands on and peeled shrimp was the easiest thing to come by and we used to hammer the fish on them so all right this would be our first cast here brand new surf rod I actually bought this surf rod one day before the beach is closed can you believe it? <laughs> Bombs away. I like it. One day before the beach is closed, me and, uh, me and Beach Bum went out and I just kind of got hooked on surf fishing again. And uh, it's like, man, I gotta, get a, I gotta get a surf fishing rod. And I bought one. And then we had that mandatory stay at home crap. So <laughs> I've never got to test it out until right now. That first rod just got hammered. I'm gonna see if he'll come back and eat it. He ju it just got hit. I got my little rod right here, guys. I'm gonna throw it short. This is gonna be my whiting rod, redfish coming down the beach, stuff like that. All right, so now it's a waiting game, man. We got three rods out right now. I'm feeling optimistic, and I'm feeling good. This is gonna be a good video. I'm, I am a uh, great morning, just super nice out here. Oh, oh, we just got smoked, guys. We just got hammered. Oh, he's still on. He's still on. Come on, fish. First fish of the, in the surf since, uh, since the beach is open. There she is. Oh, my goodness. Really? That was like the last thing I expected to catch on a surf rig is a dang lady fish. But that's exactly what we caught. Well, guys, I guess that is one fish that I didn't have a minute ago, so I'm not complaining. Let's let him go here. And let's see if we can get something that... All we can do is upgrade from now, unless we go to a saltwater catfish, man. We go to a saltwater catfish, we're just going down. All right, let's get another one out there here. All right, that was a good cast. Ooh, I'm already getting bit. Oh, oh, we're on down here, guys. We're on, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, we're on on the short rod. So, oh my gosh, really? I think it's another ladyfish. Are you kidding me, dude? So whatever this is, I saw it come out of the water completely. There's a good chance we got another ladyfish hooked up here. Is that it? Good gracious. Come on, yeah. Yep. Oh no, look at this guys. Check this out. <laughs> this is not what I was expecting to be doing this morning, okay? I got two fish on right here. I got a blue runner, hardtail right there. Listen to him croak. We're gonna toss him back. And I got a ladyfish, all right? So what does that tell you? That tells you those were, 